Hey guys, welcome to Sling Ming, another game I got a code for, and a game where you presumably sling Ming. If you want to find a link to the game, you can get it in the description. It gets to the Steam page. I think it's also, I think this game's actually also on... Oh yeah, sure, I'll try controller, if it works. Do I get responsiveness? Oh yeah, there we go. I believe this game's also on the Switch. It might be on other platforms too. What do we have for options here? Language auto? Uh... Okay, just in case. <laughs> I don't know about how much I trust the idea of auto, necessarily. And I don't know what any of these settings mean yet, so they're not relevant yet. Cool. Start. And start. Princess Ming, the earthquakes are getting stronger. Yeah, it's like the earth has come alive with the temper. Look at that swag ass run cycle. People can't lead normal lives anymore. Everybody is off balance. I wish I could do something, anything. Watch out! Okay, that's it. We need to get to the bottom of this, she says as she jumps in a hole. Yep. Ming, wait, are you... S is it safe? Oh, there he goes. He followed. Well, that's some... This is an okay art style. <laughs> that's amusing. So this is the basement. Pretty creepy. Isn't this the old Oxalane? I thought they got rid of it in the big cleanup. The Oxa what now? Before you were born, the air was so polluted it was toxic. The Oxalane provided clean air. People hooked up to the Oxalane to breathe when they went outside. It also functioned as a transportation system, quite nifty. I wonder if it's still working. Let's have a closer look, shall we? Wait, I don't think. Voila, easy as pie. Oh my, it's running. Please, put that protective suit on. You'll bump your head. Oh, I see. So look, say goodbye to your character looking like that for the rest of the game. <laughs> she looks doofy as all hell. <laughs> okay. That's... Alright, that's what this game is. Oh, this is gonna be weird. Watch out, that red and pointy, uh, rat looks dangerous. Um, I'm pretty sure that's not a rat. How do I avoid it? The oxalane is attached to the walls behind you. The attach points are called nodes. Green nodes can be moved around on the wall. Doing so adjusts the oxalane path. Remember, safety first. How do I move it? Okay, there we go. I wonder if I should just play controller then? Well, I don't know how to con I don't know how to play with the keyboard and mouse. It seems like all you would do is just drag stuff around, right? Yeah, they, 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 yeah, my mouse controls don't work anymore. I've, I've already committed at this point. But now that I know that it's about dragging things around, it seems like it's, it'd be relatively intuitive to try that. Oh, she's she was on the ground for a second there. Well, this is something unusual. Bing, are you there? <laughs> ha! Are you feeling lonely already? Don't be silly. But if you need help, call me on these terminals. Good. I feel more at ease now. You're at the gap, right? Drop the node into the socket. That should get you across. And Ming, don't fall down. Hold X and move main stick to seek marker across gaps. There we go. Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh. 
There's a gate here, but it's closed. How do I open it? Hmm, is there? Clever, yep. There is one on the wall over here. I see hexagons. But you're green when I'm not on you, which means I can move you around. Can I move you to the button? Maybe just above the button and I'll swing into it with my butt? There we go. Sure. But you know what else I see? Oh, I have to go back over here real quick. The other thing I see is weird coin that I don't fully understand yet. Let's get that. There we go. Don't know what that was for, but I have it now. Maybe you can spend them somewhere. This definitely seems like a touchscreen or mobile based input system that works nicely with like a control uh, mouse and not a controller. I chose very poorly, but I didn't know what I was getting myself into. Oh, right. I wonder if you just need to have a ton of momentum. It's like, I think that her body has to hit that. So maybe if you go really far, she would swing into it. Yep. I was right about that much. Can I just go all the way to this point if I click on it? Yep. Oh, not that far. Because that one can be moved. Can they both be moved? These bottom two? Yep. Lots of coins everywhere. Ow. And then she died. She died horribly. What tragedy. Ah, oh, the coins go away when you mess up. You have to go get them again. So, oh. I wasn't watching for that the first time around. I just got lucky. So the wa it creates a slime waterfall periodically and you have to avoid that. Oh, that was really close. Trying to judge the height where you don't get, get yourself killed. Oh. Harder than you'd think. Let's wait for the slime. Man, she swings like crazy. You have to be super careful with her all the time. Wing, or should I say sling? Gosh, you're really getting the hang of this. Use your speed and momentum to swing around corners. You're doing great, Ming. Hang in there. Yeah, just rubbing up and down this wall now. If I go up there, I can get the coin. Swing. Nope. Harder than that than expected. Do I have to swing outward? Oops. Because I don't think I can move the other one as much as I'd like to. So I think I need to swing outward and then aggro down here while she's on the side. Yep. That's a trip. <laughs> Interesting mechanic they got there. I also kind of appreciate the in-level in credits. This is a charming enough little game. What's going on over here? Well, aren't you sneaky, Mr. Arrow Man? Uh, so, uh, triangles are really your thing, huh? Phew, traveling by air van is not a breeze. Pun. Or joke, I guess. I don't even know. It's, it's really a pun, is it? I hope your over uh, oxy ride was pleasant. Wait, something. What? What's with all the smoke? Something's gone terribly wrong here. Mm. 
This door, whatever it's behind it, must be causing the earthquakes. Careful it might also be the source of great evil. Someone locked it up for a reason, I'm sure. Well, it's about to escape anyhow. We'd better get inside before it's fully awake. There are star coordinates next to the keyholes. Get the royal rocket ready. Uh, why do they always hide important things in the farthest corners of the galaxy? Mm. Promise that you'll be careful, princess. We need you back here. Mm -hmm. Sure thing. See you soon, Iso. Oh, <laughs> Iso, because he's a triangle. Yeah, yeah. I'll start investigating what's behind that diabolic door. It has a crown. It's been forever since I visited the archives. I think I'll bring a hot cuppa and a biscuit. That'd be nice. Pathos. I'm buckled up, Pathos. Up, up, and away. <laughs> Welcome on board, Princess. I have locked the star coordinates you gave me. We're heading for the first planet now. Okay, so the audiovisual presentation of this game is great. The it's charming as all hell. Uh, the gameplay even has potential to have good puzzles and gameplay in it too. But I'll, but it also seems like the exact game that would be infuriating to me if I played it for a full series, <laughs> like uh, Mushroom Eleven or whatever it's called. Our first stop is the planet Grandal. The key you're looking for is hidden somewhere in these green hills. So we have Topius, Grandal, Heta, and Blanc. And there might be more later, who knows? Who knows? I see, it's one of those Elon Musk self-landing robots. I mean, rockets. We have arrived, Princess. I hope the landing was smooth. The sensors indicated this is a good place to land, but a rocket site is unexpected. This looks very similar to the ox lane at home, Pathos. Can you scan the area? Correct. The construction is nearly identical. I also detect particle traces from Topius. Interesting. Let me out. I want to see where the ox lane leads me. We're going to unearth some sort of crazy conspiracy that explains why every planet has the same oxalane thing. There's a lot of coins to collect here if, you, if you're the type for that. Holy crap. Are all the ones over here mobile? They are, just only when you're behind them. Oh. Just touching the spikes is a problem. All right. Let's go way up here. I make this a little more livable. Yeah, one coin. I'm not doing a particularly good job. So you can move them, but only the ones that are ahead of you. That's a spe specific mechanic. You can't move these ones around that are behind you. Curious about that. Kind of thought she might shoot up and grab the coins. Let's push forward a bit and not obsess over coins too much. We only have so much time. You got five coins. You did terribly, is probably the record there. Collect 17 coins. Oh yeah, you have little medals here. Uh, click, collect 17 coins, finish in 10 seconds, don't bump your head. Oh. Okay. So, if I, I, I think that if you, uh, are gonna play for time medals, you probably want to play with, uh, either the Nintendo Switch touchscreen or keyboard and mouse. Because these slowly moving a joystick around is probably not ideal. Oh, wow. This planet's really beautiful. Green hills and mossy stones. Get over it. I mean, you need to get over that mossy stone there. 
How? I don't have a rocket in my rear, like you, Pathos. The oxy lane ahead has a speed boost modification installed. Notice the thicker lanes, they provide extra speed when you need it. It was originally scrapped for safety reasons, but... Yeah. Pedal to the metal! Tap twice to boost. Oh, okay. Neat. And I bumped her head, so I failed that objective now. <laughs> Alright, well that's some fun. And now the speed things are gone. Alright. Water does not immediately kill me, that's good to know. I think we need to get these all out of the path of the death stone. Oh, damn it. Not being able to control her- oh, we can right stick moves around the, the screen. Not being able to control her is going to be a little, a little rough. You definitely would kind of want the ability to kind of control her swing a little bit just because there's all these hazards that she'll swing back into. There we go. At least she stops her feet on the ground. Remember that you can boost on speed lanes. Speed lanes are thicker than with a moving center, like the ones up ahead. Zoom! Away she goes. She's just so psyched about it, and she has green eyeliner that's just out of control. <laughs> How do you even get some of these? I kind of thought she might do a, a flip or something. That's closer than I was thinking of. Not so much. <laughs> what is that? Oh, she got stuck and had to go back down. That's a thing she does? Huh. Nope. Let's go for the longest distance I can get, and we'll boost it. See if she swings around onto the platform. No, she doesn't go into. She doesn't go above it as much as you would hope. She does hit her head a lot though. All right, well this isn't working. What do I do with this? Oh, that's going to be its own problem. She just doesn't go up fast enough. Uh, I actually am more stuck than I would like to admit. So ring, swing left, then swing right. There we go. By the great touring. Is that an item over there on the right? An item? You mean the power cell with the highest energy density ever created? That's the one. I would leave... Who would leave an item here? Try picking it up. Sounds dangerous. Let's do it. Alright. How, though? I can't go faster. Oh. Oh. Well, this is creepy. Officially getting weirder. How far can it pull me? 
Does it eat me? I don't want to be eaten, frankly. Goodbye. All right, well, I got the item, whatever that is. Doing a lot of head bashing today. Really bad for that one score. Hey! Look at us. We should actually go back down. I think I need to make this higher. No, I can't make it higher. I can't move that one. Oh boy. This could, this could go poorly. Never mind. Oh, don't go back. Oh yeah. I did a bad job. I did a bad job on that one. What does that do? Oh, it makes me heavy. Hmm. Uh. Buttons in the ceiling? Come on, whoever built that should be fired. Agreed, it's a blatant violation of multiple accessibility guidelines. May I suggest that you throw something on the buttons, like that oversized acorn. Let's move things around first. Oh, that doesn't move. All that moves is this. Um... Hint, press Y, and Ov. Oh, and press, press Y and move main to aim. Why is that in the background? <laughs> uh, release to throw again. Oh, you can literally throw it. Okay. That's an important detail. Oh, it's coming back. Whoops. Got it. Oh, down it goes. Goodbye, friend that saved us and made us all possible and whatnot. Um... Not sure if that'll work. Physics based puzzles are always a unique agony. <laughs> yeah, oh. She really doesn't swing up as much as you'd hope. Ah, oh, well. Let's continue onwards. Oh, there's a bit more here than I thought. Creepy teeth stuff? Holding an item stretches the rope. It does. Yes. Oh, right. That's necessary for continuing. Look at how her entire body stretches. As the rope pulls on her, she completely straight. She completely straightens out on the previous location and she gets stuck. It's kind of incredible because it's pulling on the back of her suit. All the art stuff's really adorable in this game. Let's get out of here. Well, alright guys, this is Sling Ming. If you want to check this game out, there's a link in the description. I think it's on a few platforms, actually. Uh, thanks for watching, like always, guys, and I will see you next time.